Good morning, guys. I wish it was under better terms. It's not that good of a morning for us right now. We're taking uh, Melissa to the emergency room. We think she has bronchitis or something kind of bad. And Gretchen, we think she might have broken her elbow. So we're not going to pull the band aid off right now. But it is uh, pretty bad, right? But she's okay. It happened last night and it swole, it swole up like double the size. So yeah, and we'll find out what's going on soon. So the, we're going to check if it's broken. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're in good spirits. <laughs> Hey guys, so we're here in the parking lot now of the ER, and I guess Dad's gonna stay in the car and take, maybe take the kids to Starbucks or something. Yeah, I got the baby check. and Grace and Gwen, and the, the, Melissa's gonna go in. Um, she has, what do you think, you have like bronchitis? I think I have bronchitis. She gets, some, she gets infections sometimes when she lets her, when she neglects, Melissa gets infections sometimes when she neglects her health. And uh, and by that I mean she gets so busy, she just doesn't realize that she has a sinus infection or whatever it ends up being and then it just gets worse and worse and worse because she Pretty just much. powers through it. Pretty much. So um, we'll see how Gretchen does. She's in better spirits, but her elbow area is swollen up to like twice the size. Yesterday it looked like a scrape. It didn't look that bad, but it looks a lot worse now. So if it's a little crack or something, we might have to... Uh, to get a cast on that or something. What happened? Yeah, here? fuel level's low. Oh, and, good. and now we're out of gas. Well, I'll get gas and then we'll get something. So, mom's gonna take. Uh, I'm gonna take her in right now, and they're gonna go do something. But yeah, her arm is very, very swollen. So hopefully, hopefully she doesn't need a cast or there's not anything crazy wrong with it. Um, and then yeah, I have had bronchitis before. That's why I think that's. I'm not a doctor, but that's why I think I have that again because it feels <laughs> by like by no means not even <laughs> assistant to the regional doctor. Assistant to the regional doctor. Um. I've had it before, and what happened this time is that a couple weeks ago, you guys probably remember, Gemma was sick, and she gets me sick when she gets sick because, you know, she we sleep in bed together, and she likes to sneeze in my face and cough at me and, you know, all that baby stuff because she wants to snuggle, and I got sick, and then I got better, and then I got sick again. So, like, usually that's, like, a sign that it's something else, like, when you get, like, something secondary. And my throat hurts really bad, and my ears hurt, and I have a terrible cough. I was up all night with a cough. He knows, because we sleep in the same room together. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> Spoiler alert. Um, so, yeah, so we'll see Where how it goes. Where the babies come from? Okay. Oh, all right. okay. All right, let's go. Okay, here we go. I hope it's not broken either. Okay, so we were just seen, and they're ordering some antibiotics for me um, because they think it's like a sinus infection thing. It's not turned into like bronchitis or pneumonia or anything yet, but they're just gonna watch it, and I'll have to recheck in with my doctor. And Gretchen is gonna have an x-ray on her arm. Yeah, it's kind of a boo-boo. So um, we're gonna go for an x-ray for her just to make sure that it's not broken. And yeah, I mean, I guess we're just really kind of concerned because her bigger sisters have had like weird things like buckle fractures in their arms and stuff. And that's something like you don't even see coming. Like you don't think that it's anything and then it is. And anyway, so we're just being extra careful. Um, it's really swollen. So hopefully it's, hopefully it's not broken, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, so me, I'm just gonna be on antibiotics for probably like two weeks and hopefully it will kick this out and fix all my ear pain, throat pain, nasal stuff and we'll be good to go. So, anything else you want to tell the people? No, no. Just that we're here and waiting for our x-ray. Show them your boo-boo. <laughs> oh, they're back. They're back, they're back. Let's see what happened. So the weirdest hey, thing. Hey, 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 hey. Hey. Um, so, the doctor didn't even really look at it. They have to send it to a radiologist and the radiologist is gonna call us. Oh. But they said that, or the nurse or whoever was in there, she said that, um, it looked like a normal elbow, but what? the x-ray technician took like a lot of x-rays. All right, so we're back in the car. Um, the x-rays came back. They took a crazy amount of x-rays, like 15 different ones of Gretchen's arm. Um, the nurse actually said that they're gonna send them out to the radiologist to review, and that they're gonna call us and tell us if there's something going on with it. They said, if we don't hear anything, that's good news. She said that it appeared to look normal but that they they always send it to like just make sure that there's nothing else going on especially when it's like a joint or yeah like an elbow um and then i have antibiotics i've ordered into the pharmacy for me because i have a sinus ear infection thing that's i guess because of the cold i had so i have to go pick those up and yeah 
I think we'll be okay though. Gretchen, how are you feeling? How is your getting your x-ray? Medium? She kept talking about how Gwyneth had and Graceland have had x-rays before. She was like, no, I've had x-rays like my sister. The tech didn't know what to say. She's like, well, I guess that'll give you something to talk about. Gabrielle had And Gabrielle. All your sisters have had x-rays. Except Amy. So now you, Gabrielle both except Gemma, Gemma. Except Gemma. Except Gemma. Except for Gemma. Yeah. So now you guys join the, join the x-ray club. Rough and tumble. <laughs> the ex-girls. Oh my gosh. All right, guys. So we're back home now. I was able to finish getting ready. I did my hair, put some makeup on. We just did a quick little live stream to say hi to you guys and answer some questions. And Gemma woke up from her nap. She's being quite extra this afternoon. And I guess we're all just falling apart in this house because Gabrielle just got home. And tell us what happened to you. So I woke up this morning and I found a blood vessel popped in my eye. Here. So like. Go close so they can see it. You guys can see it? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Dad, did she show you this in the morning? Yeah. Yeah, wow. So we, we really are just falling apart in this house today. I don't know what's happening. I didn't know that that happened to her. I guess Dad forgot to tell me. And I was, I've been so sick that this morning I totally slept in because I took um, Ny NyQuil. Yeah, like NyQuil PM or whatever at like one o'clock in the morning. So. I was like knocked out until like nine and I think she left at like 8.30. So anyway, um, it's been quite a day. We're exhausted. I need to wait for some meds to kick in now. Um, I'm gonna be on antibiotics for the next couple weeks for my sinus infection. Gretchen's arm is still really swollen. We've been icing it and we gave her some Tylenol as well for that. And we're still waiting to hear back from the radiologist to see if there's something going on with her elbow. They hope that there's not I mean it was really weird at the doctor because the the nurse acted like well, her arm was okay but they want to send it off because of her elbow so we'll see we'll keep you guys updated on that thank you so much for watching make sure you're subscribed if you're not already and that you have your bell notification thing turned on and we'll leave all the links to our social medias down in the description box below and I guess we'll see you next time bye bye <laughs>